The community continues to answer the call for help from two area hospitals in need of medical supplies. Today, one of the biggest donations yet rolled in from a humanitarian group that donated nearly 10,000 masks to UNC Health. CBS 17's Jimmy's Price was there as the donations were unloaded. This donation of about 10,000 N95 masks loaded right here on the shelves, and you can see where it's labeled here, pandemic donation products. And to put this all in perspective on just how critical the need is, I'm told these masks will be used in the next two weeks. We are burning through personal protective equipment at a rate that which in my 20 plus years of nursing and leadership in, in, a, in a hospital have never seen before. That's why this huge donations of N95 masks from the humanitarian group Samaritan's Purse will help fill a big need for hospitals like UNC Health. We're very, very uh, thankful and we're very fortunate to, uh, to receive such a, a great gift. Christian Lawson, director of emergency services at UNC Health, says right now those on the front lines of this pandemic are using anywhere from 12 to 15 sets of PPE in a 12-hour shift. Normal, we would use maybe um, maybe 100 or 200 of N95 masks a day at, 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 at UNC hospitals in Chapel Hill. Um, now we're going through that <laughs> in a few hours, um, if, not, if not more. Lawson says supplies have been low for a number of reasons, including a spike in flu cases earlier this year, and now there's an increased demand for PPE around the world. That's why hospital leaders made the plea for help. And here's the other reason why. The call for donations was, was, was ultimately to ensure that uh, we were doing anything and everything possible to make sure we're taking care of our workforce. If we go down, then there's not anybody to back us up. These donations add to the other medical supplies that have been donated from people here in our community. I'm told within 18 hours of hospitals putting out that initial plea, 150,000 items were donated. Now, there's still room for more help, and if you would like to help, visit our CBS 17 mobile news app to find out how. In Durham, Jimmy's Price, CBS 17 News.